up our rules, particularly our standard of rating for seniors. We don't show the faces of children at the rescue by detectives from IRT. As a matter of fact, the case started sometime in June last year, 2019, when we got a report about a recent um, child stealing taking place in parts of the country. On the strength of that case, investigators from the IRT commenced invest investigators from IRT commenced investigation. In the course of the investigation, we discovered a ring, a syndicate that specialized in stealing innocent children and selling them off to intended buyers, most of whom are also some other persons looking for proofs of the womb. We were able to rescue these three, these six kids. Three of them, four girls, have been successfully reunited with their families. But since then, we've been having these children unable to trace, locate, or identify their families. We have this information out there so that family members who might have lost or who might have lost any of their own or whose children or child might have been stolen um, to come up and take a very close look at these children for possible identification. All being charged to God and they are all pulling up their heads um, in the prison. But we will not rest until we are able to reunite these innocent children with their families. And that's exactly the purpose of this brief. And so we, we want to appeal to you to help us push out this information out there. And hopefully, we'll be able to find your parents. Thank you. Okay, can I tell you? Okay. This afternoon, a total of 27 suspects. Breaking news. Parents, be aware and be vig vigilant. These kidnappers were caught stealing children for 1,000 naira. See what the police officers that caught them did to them. A kidnapper was caught in a video in Nasara State and he confessed to selling the children he adopted for 1,000 naira each. The notorious kidnapper was reportedly arrested by the police in Mararaba, Nasara State. One Louis Emmanuel, a media, moni moni a media monitoring officer, and the Nigerian Football Federation, who shared this in a Facebook post on Wednesday, 31st of March, said that the suspects identified as Umaru confessed to having kidnapped five children in Mararaba and Masaka exit of Nasara and sold them for 1,000 naira each. To the second suspect, Bawa Madaki. Finally, Umaru, the kidnapper of children in Maraba, Mararaba of and the Ma Masaka, has been arrested. Umaru said that he has kidnapped over five children within Mararaba, Masaka, exits, and also sold them for 1,000 each to Bawa. Madaki in in Masaka area there. Thank God that both of the children, uh, both of the kidnappers were arrested and born to ashes by the police. He wrote. Hmm. Recall also how is the suspect female kidnapper was born to death in Lagos. The sad story was shared by a witness 
who wrote this happened in Ijora Badia in the early hours of today one of the ghetto areas in Lagos State in the early hours of today a woman who should be around her 40s was caught by the community in the society as she was planning for ways to kidnap children in the community the woman has always been disgusting and disguise sorry disguising to be a mad woman begging for things from people and according to the people in the society it was said that the women the woman has always been begging around for things from people and it's not a first time of doing this just last week there were reports of more than two children missing in the area and have not been found till date today this lady was caught trying to give agbalumo food to young children when she was caught as she tried luring the children thank you viewers for listening to this news see videos of the kidnapped the two kidnapped men that were caught kidnapping children in Nasara State. After watching this video, you would like to drop your comments, please don't hesitate to drop your comment below the comment box. Click on the subscription button as well as the bell button for more updates. Thank you.